Hey guys, welcome back. So in the last video, we have created a pop-up dialog to show on the click of the floating action button. So in this video, we will create a database file to store the data into the database. So let's start. Okay. So first of all, create a database in the class inside this folder. Now extend the database in the class with SQLite Open Helper. And add the methods, unimplemented methods. So before writing code inside this database in a class, we will create a class name constant and we will write inside it some final values which can be used in database class. Okay. Public static final integer db version is equal to 1 public static final string db name it will be grocery list db So string table name and it will be grocery table. Okay. Now add another public static final key ID. It will be ID for the table. Key M underscore grocery name it will be grocery item then key quantity grocery quantity and the last one key date on which date we have added grocery date added okay let's write insert this database handler class okay first declare private contacts ctx and insert this super method constants dot db name the database null and the version will be context dot db uh, sorry constant dot db version okay and this dot ctx is equal to context okay. now inside this create method let's create the table for database create grocery table is equal to create table constants dot table name plus constant start key id plus integer primary key plus Constants dot the grocery item plus text plus
constants dot key quantity plus text plus constants dot key date plus long okay now db dot execute sql create grocery table okay inside this one update method we will drop the table if it is already if already exists db dot execute sql drop table if exist plus constants dot table name on create db okay so we have created a table to insert the record now we will write a method add method to save data inside the table so public void add grocery and CROC grocery grocery we will need to create a class name grocery and inside that we will create getter set a method to get the value from the database and set it inside the layout we will create later in the next video okay so now sqlite database db is equal to this dot get writable database on content values values is is equal to new content values values dot put constants dot key grocery item comma grocery dot get name use dot put constants dot key quantity key quantity comma grocery dot get quantity values dot put constants dot key data and the date will be java dot length dot system dot current millisecond okay now db dot insert constants dot table name comma null comma values okay and uh, let's write a log dot d saved save to db okay. so now currently this get name and get quantity are showing error because we have not created the grocery class when we will declare this value the error will be got okay in the next video we will create a method inside this save button on click event and we will save the data inside the database and we will also create this grocery class so see you guys in the next video please like share and don't forget to subscribe clueless tech